Welcome to Government e Marketplace. In this module, we will learn the processing of payment using PFMS mode of payment. Buyer bill draft process. Open gem.gov.in and click on login. Enter user ID, the captcha text and click submit. Enter your password and click here to proceed. Click on dashboard. Click here to proceed. Click here to process the bill. All the details pertaining to the selected bill can be viewed here. Scroll down and click to process bill to add the deductions. Click on yes to impose deduction and add deduction to deduct multiple amounts. Buyer will be able to apply LD charges with all the other deductions as shown below. PFMS bill for the services. Offline form for products. If deductions are not required, click on no. Click on Save Draft Bill. Draft Bill will be saved successfully. DDO Payment Process. Click here to proceed. After buyer drafts the bill, DDO will generate the final bill and initiates the payment. Scroll down and click to Process Bill to add the deductions. Click on Yes to impose further deductions if any. Click on Edit Final Bill to make changes or select Submit Final Bill to save and submit the final bill for processing. Select yes and click here to return the bill to buyer. Click here to proceed and click here to proceed to upload the correct approval. Enter the OTP and click here to verify. A message will display that payment has been initiated. Once payment is approved and transaction is in process, you will see the relevant notification. DDO can check the payment status of the bill by clicking here. In case payment is successful, bill will be marked as paid. In case bill payment is failed, DDO will have option to return the bill to buyer. Payment process. Return bills. In DDO screen, select yes and click here to return the bill to buyer to upload the correct approvals. In buyer screen, click here to continue and upload the correct financial approval. Scroll down. Click here to upload the relevant financial approval. Click here to save the draft bill and send back to DDO for payment. Unblocking fund. Unblocking fund. Bills in terminal state. Option 1. From manage excess fund option on bill summary page. When the bill is marked as closed, manage excess funds option is available to the user on the bill detail page to unblock the remaining balance. Click here to unblock the remaining balance. After clicking on the Manage Excess Funds option, the user will be redirected to Payment Release page and can unblock the remaining funds by clicking on the Release Remaining Funds option. Click here to unblock the remaining funds. Budget released successfully. Option 2. From Order Summary page. Users will get the Manage Budget option on Order Summary page. On clicking the button, User will be redirected to the unblocking page. Click here to proceed. Click here to unblock. User has to upload the approved PDF file and click on Unblock Amount button to release the remaining fund. Users will get confirmation on successful unblocking of the fund. Unblocking fund. Bills not in terminal state. Users can unblock the fund at any stage of the order except for the condition that no bill should be in payment initiated state. For unblocking of the fund, users have to go to order detail page, order summary page. There they will get the manage budget option. Click here to proceed. Upload the approval PDF and click here to release the fund. Users will get confirmation on successful unblocking of the fund. Thank you.